Hello viewers, in this video I'm going to show you how we can create automated attendance sheet for months in Excel. You see how it automatically updates itself. For example, uh, here I selected month February, directly this is column change, also the title changes. For example, I change this one to 24, directly title change and the days change. Here if I add 0, you see it become 91 percent also gradient field change if you want to create a tendance sheet like this watch to the end but please don't forget to like the video and leave a feedback in a comment section it helps me to improve my tutorials and help you better let's start first you have to have a data sheet there must be months and years you see here and from attendance sheet here i come to here and select three of sellers and merge and center here also three merge and center name it month from here again i need three cell merge and center three cell merge and center name this one yeah select this one then from data go to data validation select list click this icon go to our data sheet select it, the months good enter okay directly here i have this months i can select it for example i select january for here again from data validation list go to data select zeros enter okay now from here control v i have this id you can put id or any other column you can add if you want to add more information then from here i add equal sign date value concat this one this one there is here close and enter yes good now let me select it here good just change the cell format right click format cell from date for example i select it this type okay you see face of january for the cell just equal to this one plus one it become second of january and go to thirty one January. Good. Now, if I select this and change alignment again, right click, format cell, go to alignment, change it to ninety degree. Okay. Now select this cells and change its thickness now i think it's good just the cell bring it to here good you can change this field for example i change it to this this one to this one good also you can change this field for example to this now from here i can add attendance day good this one total and attendance percent good now just change its alignment select them select it right click format cell alignment change it to 90 degree okay bring it to center and here again good you can change color now select all these cells then conditional formatting new rule from here select it icon status change this one to number this one to number also 
select the stick and for this one this add one here for this one select no cell icon and show icon only now okay okay now if i just add one you see it shows a tick and if i add zero it shows a cross it means it's absent now if i select for all good here let's add more for the cell just equal sign count if select this range and add attendance one close and enter you see i have three attendance it directly sum all the three days which is a student comes for this total just equal sign count a at this range good it's four days it count all the days and from attendance person just equal to this one divide by this one enter and change it to percent good now select this cell and drag to the end good now if i change a cell here for example one you see how it changes just i want to add border from border more border select it this color okay here i need border this color good now just bring it to the center good for the cell just select all then conditional formatting new rule select it data bar from here select number from here select number zero two one change this color to this one select solid border color again to this one okay it's good if i add for example i add zero one okay good now it's ready if i change this one to zero it's good eight another one you see how it changes also from here just merge and center equal to attendance sheet for space quotation the symbol this one the symbol again quotation dash quotation the symbol and the year the symbol double quotation enter now change it to bold change its size to good and i want to fill it good now you can fill this one by white this one white white good now you have automated advanced attendance sheet if i just add zero here you see how it changes now i can use and for another month for example for april directly change for another year that's all don't forget to like and leave a comment have a nice day